What the fuck? Jonathan Davis of Corn got money. Space Ashes says John Browse. You know, I'm gonna take this as a riddle. All right, John Browse. That's I, I think I know what to expect with this now. Oh my god. By the way, I love this song. I, I listened to this on repeat literally on my way back from rehab like two days ago when I was driving home. I just had Got Money playing over and over again. If you haven't heard the original, here it is. It slaps. <laughs> I need the max win. That's, you get the point if you heard that, but I saw T-Pain live recently with, he, he opened up for Pitbull, bro. That was like the greatest concert ever. T-Pain and Pitbull and like the crowd was so hype. There was at least 50 people there dressed up like Pitbull, like with a bald cap and glasses, like the whole Shabazz and then a suit. Like people got really into it. You know, and then being a part of this crowd, like, oh yeah, and then Pitbull, what would happen is every time he finished a song, because T-Pain uh, got us doing this, we would go, hoo, hoo, hoo. it was like, rah, rah. like everyone would make dog noises between every single song. They would just be barking like, oh my God, the Pitbull concert was so good, dude. Like that kind of energy was unbelievable.
freaking rain on them hoes like Young girl. JD. Everybody say, Mr. Rain Man, can we have a rainy day? Bring an umbrella, please bring an umbrella. Ella, Ella, Ella. <sighs> Bitch ain't shit but a hoe in a trick, baby. No one ain't trick if you got it. You know he ain't fucking if you not thick. And it cool your ass down if you think you're hot shit. So Rolex, watch this. I do it for five, six, my click. Crack goes a black hole pimp And just like I blow that shit Cause bitch I'm the bomb like tick Tick Got money And you know it Take it out your pocket and show it Then throw it like This way That way This way That way AKA Mr. Make It Rain on them hoes. All right, you're not going to like what I have to say here. Um, I think that this cover is great. I'm going to give it a smiley ball. Uh, realistically, listen, if we're able to put up with Lil Wayne's voice on the original song, there's no way in hell that we're going to start complaining about Jonathan Davis, all right? Like, realistically, like... Like, Lil Wayne is not a good singer, dude. You know what I mean? Like, sure, the auto-tune's ridiculous, but also at the same time, it's overstimulating. And the song is never boring, so... And this way, that way. I think it's a very, uh... Honestly, a pretty great cover. It's very faithful to the original. You know? 